Hello and welcome back to AP Tech Tutorial. In this short video I'm going to show you how to deploy a printer in your network using group policy. First you'll need to install and uh, the printer in uh, print management if you do not have that already. Uh, you can follow uh, one of my videos in this channel uh, that will show you how to install a printer using the um, the role uh, print management. Okay, So that's that's the first step. Uh, I've already completed that so you can watch my video if you don't have that printer installed. Um, I have print management here and as you can see I have my printer installed there. Um, this will list you the different drivers uh, one of which is the um, the uh, the PCLC that I installed for this uh, particular uh, printer. The uh, printer is called the Recode SL 3600. Um, so I'm going to proceed and then uh, push uh, this printer to my clients uh, and uh, via uh, group policy. So in order to push this printer that I've already installed via group policy all I need to do is right click and then select deploy with group policy. Now once I come here I'm just gonna browse and I'm going to select the policy that I've it's already configured in group policy. I'm going to use for the purpose of this exercise the default domain policy which is going to include all printers in my uh, and users in my uh, domain. Okay, my domain as you remember is lab.local. So I'm just going to click OK and I'm going to uh, select either by user or by uh, computer. The difference is that by user it's faster because you will only need to log off and log back on to see the printer. Uh, computer, uh, you will need to do uh, either uh, uh, GP uh, update force in both the domain controller and in the print in the um, in the computer itself, uh, it, or you will need to restart the computer in order to do that to, to for the printer to be visible. For the purpose of this exercise, I'm just going to deploy it uh, only to users. I'm just going to call add and then applied. Okay, printer the protocol just did it. Okay, click OK, and that's it. And when you come here, you'll see that I already deployed this printer in uh, in um, using GPO. So now I'm going to back to one of the client's computer and show you uh, how the printer was automatically installed because it was pushed to that uh, particular user. So this is the user that I will test. Uh, if the printer will be pushed by group policy, as you can see here, if you this is a Windows 7 computer, device and printer, the printer is not listed here. I will proceed to uh, log off and uh, log back on, and then um, I'll show you the printer in a minute. Hello, I'm going to show you now. Uh, this is a Windows uh, 7 PC. I'm just going to show you how this uh, particular user, uh, which is uh, John Manager. Um, have his printer automatically uh, pushed to his uh, PC uh, via group policy. If you click on devices and printers you can see here that's the printer that actually I deployed uh, using uh, group policy. I hope you liked this video and uh, if, you if you liked it just click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a great day.